The lovely legal ladies of YouTube. Let's talk about them. Um What's up, blind viewers? How you doing? Uh, all right. The lovely legal ladies of YouTube. Now, I started watching these uh, court proceedings. I watched the uh, Kyle Rittenhouse trial. I watched all that. There was another one I watched where it was an, an elderly man. He was out at the movies, and he was attacked, and he shot someone. And uh, I've been watching the uh, <laughs> Johnny Depp Amber Heard fiasco not all of it but in and out watching the good parts and uh there are some channels that i watch and i watch for a reason and i want to share them with you and hope that uh i can steer you in a in a direction that if you are into the watching the court stuff and and you just don't want to watch the court tv or just the proceedings and have it roll by you want a little help you want a little bit of uh insight from some legal experts and uh, I, I find it enjoyable, and I find it a little bit easier to swallow and watch these things when I watch these young ladies. That's right. The lovely legal ladies of YouTube. Okay, well, let's start with, uh, we'll start with Emily D. Baker. Now, I uh, watch her. She is, <laughs> she's a hoot. I, I really enjoy her channel a lot. Um well, let's just take a look. We'll go over to her channel, take a look, and we'll talk about her about section and see what she has to say about herself. So as we go over here and we look, we'll go into her about, and we will read what Emily says about herself here. I'm Emily D. Baker, everyone's favorite legal commentator. I've been an attorney for over 16 years, and this channel provides legal analysis that helps you understand the law with humor, cursey words, that's right, <laughs> and our own law nerd dictionary. Remember, this is commentary, this is not legal advice. I know I'm cool, but I am not your lawyer. <laughs> There's no attorney client relationship <laughs> formed through interaction with this channel or sending super chats and it goes on to say some other things but yeah uh cursey words it is interesting because <laughs> she is a delight she's a trip all right now when it comes to emily she has uh her little format she does where she will have the uh the trial up and she will be in a little square similar to what you just saw with me and she does her commentary as the trial goes on. No, she doesn't talk over the important parts. Um, she does put up stuff from the chat and she will answer questions. Um, if they're having sidebar or it's quiet time or during the, the breaks, the morning and the evening breaks and lunchtime, all that, she answers questions, but she does, uh, do her, <laughs> her commentary. And, uh, as she said, she is not afraid of the cursey words. And I like that because I curse all the damn time. And I don't care if YouTube likes it or not. I'm a damn grown adult and I'll say whatever the fuck I want to. How about that? <laughs> but yeah, she is uh, very knowledgeable. She doesn't overstep her bounds. If she doesn't know, no, this isn't my, but she is very cool. Very cool. Uh, I enjoy her a lot. And I think again, when you're, when you're listening to some of this stuff and you're like, well, why is that hearsay? And why is that not, not, or, if what 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 are they talking about? What is this? And how come they're doing a sidebar for that? What is the deal? She explains all this stuff, so it comes through, and you're going, oh, 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 okay, I get it now. So it helps you along the way as a lay person when you don't really know what's going on. It kind of helps me. And plus, she's a hoot. She is hilarious. I enjoy her a lot. I think <laughs> I think she's great. But uh, she is not the only one that I watch. There is another one, and. Uh, she does things a little bit differently. She has a different kind of format. And uh, her channel name is Legal Bites. So let's go take a look at Legal Bites and what she has to uh, say in her little about section. Now, her name is Alita. Isn't that a pretty name? I think that's a pretty name. All right. Alita is an attorney licensed to practice in California and D.C. She graduated from the University of Texas School of Law after getting her undergraduate degree 
from the University of California, San Diego, with a major in history and a minor in sociology. She loves picking apart movies, TV shows, and all forms of literature. And is terrible at experiencing all of them with other people because she has a nasty tendency to pick out major plot and twist early and vocalizes them for everybody else. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, let's see. What else does she say here? Legal Bites and Legal Bites Media is a legal education company aimed at the making uh, the law more accessible, relatable, and fun for the everyday person. Leaves goal with this channel and this company is to educate people on the law so they can understand the world around them better, make better informed decisions, and ultimately live their best lives. So that's what uh, this young lady is all about, a legal bites. Um, but her format is a little bit different. Now she has, uh, times where she speaks by herself and she's there and she talks, but she has a panel. So it's not just like, unlike, like Emily, Emily, it's, it's whatever her opinion is and what her take on things are. When, uh, Alita does it on legal bites, she has a panel. Um, there's Viva Fry, who's a Canadian. So you get that Canadian twist and. You know, because the law is different. Um, Nate, the lawyer. Uh, there's all kinds of folks that come popping in um, throughout the day. But she usually has at least three or four and sometimes more uh, other people in the panel. So it's nice to hear them not argue, but go back and forth and, you know, give their takes on on things. And uh, you have some that are experts on, you know, different things. So, like, for instance, the, the Rittenhouse trial. When I was watching that, they had someone who was, uh, you know, very knowledgeable on, you know, self-defense and the right to retreat and, and, you know, all that stuff to carry part of it. So uh, he was very helpful. And then you have other people that have, you know, family law and this guy. So it's very interesting to hear their things. And, uh, uh, you know, sometimes during the day I'll pop between the two ladies. And uh, even Mrs. Views, she is a big Emily fan. She watches Emily through the day. She's been uh, kind of caught up with the Depp Heard trial. But she does prefer Emily. And uh, she doesn't like the, all the banter and the chatter of all the other people. Plus, uh, she just enjoys Emily. <laughs> and I do, too. I think Emily is awesome. But uh, I just wanted to let you know my thoughts on these two lovely legal ladies <laughs> here on YouTube. And I know I'm very interested in some of these trials. And when I sit down and watch, I like to get the opinions of experts while it's going on. They clear things up for me and uh, I enjoy it it's a lot better than just sitting down and listening to just the trial. I like the commentary on the side. You may not, and you don't have to agree with me. Because you know, that is never, ever, ever the point here. The point is, this is Blind Views, and yep, that's the way I see it. What we do here is go back, 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 back.